Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Stacy, and I'm so happy to see you here today. If you are new to my channel, I am a weeb. I am a geek. I am a nerd. I am a Twitch streamer. I am a cat mom. I am a world traveler. I am a former volleyball player and I love learning new things. And the entire purpose of my channel is for me to broaden my horizons in the realm of music and listen to songs, bands, and artists I've never heard before. And so today we are continuing our Ren journey and we are listening to the highly requested song called Chalk Outlines. To all the people in the Renegade, thank you all for supporting me in my Hi Ren and Jenny and Screech videos. You guys have seriously been amazing with your overwhelming positive comments. Seriously, thank you guys so much for your amazing comments and support. Ren has also been one of my favorite artists that I have reacted to so far on this channel, so I'm really excited to continue my journey with him. So just a little disclaimer before we begin, I do not have a musical background, nor have I ever been trained or taught about music in the past. So if I say something that is incorrect, please be sure to correct me in the comments, but also please be nice. I have been learning so much on this journey because of y'all's comments and y'all's teaching. So thank you all for being here and for teaching me along the way. So without further ado, let's get into the reaction. Okay, so this is Ren and Chinchilla. So I have never heard Chinchilla before, don't know their music. So excited to see what Ren does with a little collab. So let's just see what this is about. The music videos from Ren are so cool. So good. So, so much quality coming from them. This is beautiful. My goodness. I'm going to back it up before we begin uh, again. What amazing talent from Ren, as usual. Seriously, amazing emotion coming from his voice. Even the guitar. The guitar has so much emotion behind it. And the combination of the two is so powerful. Just incredible. Ren is incredible. I love his voice too. It kind of, I don't know if this is correct, but it kind of sounds reggae in some ways. Like I just love the way that he uses his voice in so many different facets. It just goes to show you how talented he truly is. But enough of me talking. I don't want to inter interrupt too much. So let's just keep going. Mama, oh, mama, erase us. 
ourselves in these chalk outlines. Sertraline and the sip of serotonin. Chinchilla. Wow, gorgeous voice. So it goes, let it be. In the gallows, I'm balanced on my toes so I can breathe. But little by little, bit by bit, I push it back down with a new habit. If not for Okay, I have to give a couple more thoughts. Oh my gosh, what a duo. They sound so beautiful together. And the emotion coming from Chinchilla's voice is impeccable too. I just love the way these two sing together. Oh my God, this, this song is filled with so much emotion. It's so heavy, but the music is so beautiful. I love how Ren makes me feel with his music. He makes me feel a very emotional empathetic side but the music just slapped so hard along with it that i'm like Ooh, <laughs> i'm just like i want to dance you know but like it's it's so it, it's such an interesting contrast you know i feel like i'm at i have like a battle going on with my emotions sometimes when i'm listening chinchilla is such a pleasant surprise again i've never heard of her before i've never heard her sing before so she really is just crushing this and Oh, God, they sing so well together. I'm so impressed. So let's conclude the song and keep going. It's such a perfect day. Take it just in case. Take it just in case. I'm scared of being okay. Because all things change. All things change. Oh, the lyrics. It's such a perfect day. It's a beautiful shame. It's a beautiful shame. Wow. I'm scared of being okay. There's all things change. But little by little, bit by bit, I'll push it back down with a new habit. If not for long, just for a while, I'll bury myself with a great big smile. Oh, my, my, oh, my, my, we trace ourselves in these chalk outlines. Oh, my, my, oh, my, my, we raise ourselves in these chalk I can't breathe. Oh my God, I can't breathe. This just takes my whole breath away. Wow, this was, this was heavy. The lyrics are very heavy, but amazing. This song is incredible. This, this whole thing is incredible. Their voice is so powerful together and I cannot believe how he does this live. Like they just, they just crush it. They just know how to use their voices in such amazing ways I could never even dream of using. I'm just so impressed with Ren and Chinchilla. She's an amazing surprise to me and I'm glad to have been introduced to her through this song. Wow. I, I again, I feel like I'm battling my emotions sometimes. Like I, I just love the music. I love the song and everything, but the emotions that come with it are so heavy and they are painful sometimes. And it's just like, 
a little battle going on, but I appreciate the experience. I appreciate feeling these things. And I love being introduced to music that makes me feel these things. It it is such a treat and treasure and I don't take it for granted by any means. So I really appreciate this song so much. This song is so powerful. It is so relevant to so many people who go through trials and tribulations, uh, depression, sadness, anxiety, anything of the sort. We all are human. We all feel these things every now and then. It is so natural. And I love that Ren brings a spotlight to these things. It makes us feel okay for feeling these things or going through these things. Like we, I think as a collective become stronger through his music because he unifies us. It is amazing what a song or a message can do to bring people together. I think Ren's music is so powerful in that it can unify us and bring people together. The line of I'm scared of being okay because all things change is just so, oh my gosh, so relevant to my own life. Like whenever things are going well in my life, I'm like, okay, great. I have anxiety now because I'm wondering what the next bad thing in my life is going to be. It should happen any day now, any second, any minute. And he put it in words so beautifully. He just captured exactly what I feel all the time. I think a lot of people experience that, you know, life is good. Things are going okay. And then suddenly you're just wondering when the next bad thing will happen to you. What's going to happen next? This isn't going to last forever. And I think it's so normal and human to think that sometimes when they say things like take this one, it will make you feel better. Just wash it down. Then it will ease you, you know, all these sort of things. It really makes you think. And it really says, hey, You know, you can have such a perfect day, but just in case, take this, do that to make sure that, you know, you will be okay just temporarily. It's no secret that sometimes taking medication all the time can make you feel like a different person, can make you feel lethargic, less energetic, going through emotions, just not feeling passionate about anything, sort of like a zombie in some ways. And, oh man, Ren is... Ren just has a way with words. He is able to capture things that are so complex and so uh, complicated but relevant and just compile it into an amazing song. Going through the motions in life can be a defeating feeling. Um, I know I felt defeated when I felt that way. And it's hard to get out of it. It's hard to break free from the schedule or the structure that you have put onto yourself. But I think the chalk outline analogy really encompasses everything people may feel when they go through things like this. You know, when you think of a chalk outline, you think of when somebody gets murdered or there is a crime scene, people will outline the bodies or I guess law enforcement will outline the bodies to show like where someone was during that crime scene. They will remove the body and then the chalk outline is there where that person either died or was when the crime happened. And I think that analogy is just a perfect description of what maybe we sometimes experience when we are medicated or maybe coming down from medication, like we just feel like a dead body or we just feel like we are nothing. Or maybe we feel just like an outline. You know, we see the outline of our body, but there is nothing inside. And I think that is an incredible and creative and brilliant analogy to describe exactly what people go through. You feel dead, you feel empty, you feel hollow, you feel like a corpse or anything of the sort. I think it absolutely encapsulates exactly what Ren is trying to say in his lyrics and the feeling that comes from the lyrics. I feel like a lot of us feel this way, but Ren just has a beautiful way of putting what we feel into words in a creative and beautiful manner. And it's so hard to do, but he seems to do it so effortlessly. And I know that he has gone through his own medical hardships and his own trials and tribulations, but I think he does such a good job at relaying his message to all of us that needs to hear it. I think these lyrics 
And his songs just hit us so hard for the people that experience similar things that maybe he has experienced. And again, like I said before, his songs are very unifying in that aspect. I admire Ren for unapologetically sharing himself and sharing his experiences in life with the rest of us. It is very inspiring, even for me, you know, I have my own little corner of the internet and it is so inspiring for me to see someone so much bigger than I am just get so vulnerable with his audience and interact with his audience on such a personable level. I I love it. I I really, really appreciate it. He is such a rare talent and gift to this world. And the fact that he's able to just let all of us into his life, I think is so admirable. The voices that carry this message though, between Chinchilla and Ren, oh my gosh, so powerful. So much weight and power and talent behind their voices. They sound like such a force together. And I really love how they combine forces to create such a beautiful emotional song together. Very talented. I Again, I've never heard of Chinchilla, but she just really blew it out of the water with this one. His songs just have so many layers to them. And I feel every single second of the lyrics, of the music, of everything. And I think that's what makes him so much different than many other artists I've heard. He just is able to grip your soul and take take hold of your heart and play with it, but carefully. I find that to be very cool and really masterful. He knows what he's doing and I trust Rem. When I go through these videos and these songs and I'm reacting to them, I completely trust him to take me on a beautiful journey to make me feel something, make me feel like I can become vulnerable, even in front of you guys in in front of the camera filming my reaction. And I love that. I love the way he makes me feel when I'm listening to his music. And I just, I really appreciate him as as an artist and how relatable he is. It's so, it's so nice to see an artist that's so personable like he is. And the talent is undeniable, especially between these two. Just pure talent, amazing power. I really, really love them. And I hope they do more songs together. I think this song is just out of this world amazing. And I hope that they do more collabs in the future because I love the contrast between Ren's voice and Chinchilla's voice. They really just are a force to reckon with. I, I'm a big fan of the two. Regardless of it all, final thoughts, I really connected with the song yet again. I can empathize with Ren and everything that he has been through personally and how all of us have been through very similar things. You know, I've been through very similar things. I know all of you guys have been through very similar things. And the way that we can unify under his music is just so beautiful to me. And I really, really love it. I love this experience and I can't wait to react to more Ren in the future. So guys, I think that will do for today's reaction. Thank you all again so much for watching. If you guys liked this video, please be sure to like it and subscribe to the channel as it really helps growing content creators like me. If you guys are interested in supporting me in some other way and checking out some of my other content, please be sure to check out the links in the description box. And if you guys are interested in seeing me live on Twitch, I am live right now at twitch.tv slash DCRPG, where you can see moments like this. Symbols of power born. That sounds stupid. <laughs> Just... <laughs> That's what I am. Wow, Amy. <laughs> Sorry. It just sounds like more lame than the other ones. <laughs> The link to my Twitch is also in the description box. And last but not least, I want to give a huge shout out to my patrons. Patrons, thank you again for your support and for your contributions to my channel. Seriously, it means the world to me. You guys are helping me get a step closer to hopefully one day becoming a full-time content creator. So thank you guys so much. Another beautiful song under my belt from Ren, and there is so much more to react to. So please sound off in the comments or join the Discord if you have any more reaction suggestions. And I will see you in the next video. Take care.